Hello again, Wanda Tibeto of Faithful on the Clock here. And I just want to take a quick moment to talk to you about being professional and choosing your market. And basically, um, I had had a conversation um, with an executive that I was doing an interview with for a piece that I was writing. Um, and our conversation had kind of turned to, you know, how do you balance, um, you know, attracting people to your business and yet at the same time adhering to your Christian values? Because not everybody is going to like that, right? So there is that balance, you know, where you want to have those values that you're very clear about. Um, and yet at the same time, understanding that if you are assertive about a certain thing, that, that's going to turn certain people off. And my message for you today is just that that is okay. It is the same as in any other market. Like say you, ha you were a tech company, right? Um, like Apple is really well known for, um, you know, targeting a, a certain kind of person for the, their interface and all that. They're not trying to get everybody, right? They go after their market. And in the same way, you can be a Christian company and go after the people that are going to adhere to your values. That's okay. That's your market. Okay. You don't have to get everybody to be successful. What's going to make you successful is if you go after the, the target market that you want, right? That Christian market with your Christian values and you're consistent about it because the consistency is going to build trust, the trust build relationships, the relationships build loyalty. Okay. That's kind of how that goes. Um, so don't be afraid to adhere to those Christian values because you're just narrowing your niche. That's all you're doing. And, and business professionals, whether they're Christian or not, they do that every day. Okay, so don't be afraid of it. That's my message. Take care, everybody. Bye.